Hey guys, Sanjay here and in this video I am going to show you how to install any custom ROM using TWRP recovery on the EU Euphoria as you can see this is the Euphoria and to install any custom ROM you need to have TWRP recovery on your device uh, that's the custom recovery required to flash any custom ROM and if you do not have TWRP recovery installed then don't worry I'll give a guide link in the description box below just follow that guide and flash TWRP recovery on your device and after you have flash TWRP recovery, simply long press the power button, select reboot, select recovery, uh, by this we will boot into the recovery mode and it ok. And to install the custom ROM, you need to have the zip file of that custom ROM and the gaps package required to install the Google application. So in this case, I am going to flash the CM12.1 nightlies. So I have the zip file package of the CM12.1 and as cm12.1 is based on 5.1.1 that's the android version so i have downloaded the 5.1.1 gaps too uh, which are required to flash google apps or you can call it g apps i call it gaps uh, whatever you like so guys as you can see we have successfully booted into the twrp recovery and guys the first thing you should and you have to do is backup the current rom so that if anything goes wrong afterwards then you can simply restore this backup and you will be always on the safer side and this is recommended for all devices and whenever you are flashing any new custom rom then do backup the current rom that's very very important step and it is to be on the safer side if you are expert in flashing and you know how to flash custom roms and how to get back if you get into boot loop then this might not be for you but if you are starter in this then surely backup the current rom and that's one of the most important step and backing up of ROM may take around uh, 5 minutes or 10 minutes or it may take even longer if you have uh, more amount of data on your device like if you have Asphalt 8 or, and uh, pretty big games or heavy games installed on your device everything will be backed up and that will take time so just sit back and relax the ROM will be installed So guys as you can see backup has been completed successfully so now just go back and now we need to wipe data cache and dalvik cache so in twrp recovery what you have to do is simply hit wipe button over here and just swipe to factory set this will wipe your data uh, rather phones data cache and dalvik cache so you do not have to go out again and wipe something else so that's very easy and uh, that works like that and wiping cache dalvik cache and data may take very long time uh, it may take longer than uh, it takes to back up the rom so just sit back and relax because it requires ext4 fs partition and this problem was present on the eureka 2 like it it takes very long time to wipe the data cache and dalvik cache so i'll i'll just put the device now because it takes very very long time So guys as you can see over here factory reset is also completed now simply hit back and factory reset took a very long time to complete so guys now we need to install the rom zip file and the gas package for that go into install then go into the folder wherever you have put the zip if your zip file is present in your external sd card then hit over here at the top where it says internal storage hit over there and select micro sd card and hit ok now it will go into micro sd card and you can install the zip file from there but my file is present in internal storage so i selected internal storage and now simply select the rom zip file after you select the rom zip file simply swipe to confirm flash and now it will flash the rom zip file and it will take a little bit of time so just wait for it to complete so as you can see we have successfully installed the rom zip file and now we need to install the gaps package so simply select home once again now select install and now select the gaps package or the gapps package necessary to be installed and for me the gaps package is over here so simply select this and just wipe to confirm flash and the gaps package will be installed so guys as you can see the gaps package installation has also been completed now so simply hit back button and now come back 
and now we have installed the gaps package and the rom zip package and it's always recommended or rather you have to install the rom package first and then install the gaps package and by using this method you can install any custom rom on the euphoria uh, using twr recovery so after you are done simply hit reboot and select system now we'll boot into the rom package uh, whichever rom you have installed so yeah so this is it for this video guys thank you for watching uh, don't forget to hit the like button if you like this video and if you have any doubts suggestions or queries uh, about rom flashing on euphoria then do let me know about that in the comment section below i'll surely try to answer your queries and uh, yeah if this helped you in any way then don't forget to hit the like button and many more videos on euphoria are already on the channel and are going to come pretty soon so don't forget to hit that subscribe button so thank you guys thank you for watching